on with them. Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Welcome to the channel if it is your first time here around here. So as you know what's been coming, we've got a UK versus Canada snack wars video. And here we've got joining from Canada my cousin Josh. Say hello Josh. <laughs> He sounds a bit like a robot, guys, but you know, there's not a lot we can do about the um, signal, it'll improve as it comes. So, um, right, I'm going to open this box. Josh, open yours. Let's see what we've got in here, guys. Ugh. So, um. Who the hell? Oh, there's still a tape on it. So, um, what we did, guys, is we agreed. That we do, um, we spend about 20 quid each, and then there'll be postage on top. Uh, my postage was about 23 quid, but Josh is about 100 dollars, wasn't it? It said that your postage was about 101 dollars. Yeah, why do you sound such like a robot? This is annoying. Um, let me see if I can fix. screen record there, record with mic, and we're back guys, sorry about that, we had a few technical issues there, so I'm just going to finish opening this box, have you got yours open Josh? Hey, right. Oh, look at this, guys. Check all this out. Woo. Oh. Whoa. Whoa. That'll be better. There we go. Check all this out, guys. We'll go through these. Josh has got his open. Give us a good view, Josh. Yeah, look at all that guys, we all know what that stuff is and um, Josh actually will know what that is as well because Josh is obviously my cousin so he's from here, he's from Leeds, he's from the UK so he knows all these snacks um, but he'll definitely be missing some of them so when we agreed to this video I said to him is there anything like one thing you know that you want you know that it won't be a surprise for him he's like yes I want a chicken and mushroom pot noodle <laughs> so he's got his chicken and mushroom pot noodle so he'll definitely be enjoying them so, um, I guess we're just going to go through it and taste some stuff. If you don't want to open all your stuff now, Josh, you don't have to. That's absolutely fine because obviously you already know what that stuff is and you know what it tastes like. So if you want to save some for later, go for it. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to try a bit of everything and then I'm going to let the kids have a taste on that as well afterwards. So, um, jerky. Oh, jerky. So guys, I keep looking over here. Apologise, that's because I've got Josh on camera over here on the live, which you'll be seeing edited into the video. Uh, but yeah, beef jerky. My mum's also hiding in the corner over here as well. Is off Oh, wow, that smells strong. Oof, 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 oof. Oof, it's Jack Link's original beef jerky. Oh, that is strong. It doesn't actually smell bad though. No, let's give it a go. It's like pepperoni without the spice and not as um, not as processed. I'm 50-50 on that though. I actually kind of want to spit it out. <laughs> spit it out and get a bucket. <laughs> I'm gonna have to put it out, I can't follow it. <laughs> yeah, that is not that is not for me. Woo! What have you got in your hands, Josh? You're cracking out open. Space Raiders, we love a bit of Space Raiders, don't we? Beef, it's the best way to go as well. Um, um, oh, that jerky is crazy, guys. One of, one of my favourites are um, Space Raiders. They're super cheap. The real life. Do you remember when Space Raiders were about, were they 10p at one point, 15p? About 15, 20p I think it was. Then they went to 20, to 25, and now they're 30p, 30 30p 30 bloody pack, it's mental that, innit? That's mad. I've got some crisps as well. I've got K 
ketchup flavoured Lay's? Ketchup? I don't even like ketchup normally, I'm like a mayo guy or a sriracha. I'll give that a crack, I'll give it a crack. Oh, the colourful guys, oh, check them out. What? Cats love crisps. <laughs> I mean, cats love crisps, guys. Check the colour on that, guys. They're mad red, them, aren't they? Yeah. Let's go for it. Ketchup, guys. Is it Heinz ketchup or just ketchup? <laughs> Yeah, they're fine. Not even a really strong flavour, to be fair. Reminds me more of like fresh tomato than it does actually ketchup. Hmm, yeah, fine though. I'll, I'll probably munch more later, but I'm not going to start eating full packets. I've got a lot to try here, a lot to get through. And like I'm going to share this for the kids. Sour Patch Kids Heads. Two flavours in one. What have you got there? We've got some um, dames. Dames? I call them dimes. <laughs> but it, it is dame, no, you, you say it right. Oh, nice. Uh, right, sour patch kids, guys, check it out. Oh, rip top packet. Check them out. Ooh, yes. Oh, hey, got some strong flavour. That is nice. Oh, I've been suffering for too fake a bit recently as well. This is going to kill me, this. <laughs> oh, they're very, very sweet. They're, they're packing a punch of flavour, them guys. I'm going to have to put these into some like food bags and stuff when I'm done. Them, them dime bars, I got them when I was in Bridlington. Oh, yeah. What else have we got here, guys? I've got some big old chocolate bars. Cheez-Its! Cheezies! Check out them, guys. They look like they've got some proper strong flavour. They're like super orange. Does that orange have stained the packet? Real cheddar cheese. Made with real cheddar cheese blood. Yeah, imagine Chris made from real cheese over there. Haven't got a chance. Ooh, ooh! Got a colour on that, guys. That's a good cheese, it. They're mine, kids that are in them. Cats are here. The cats are in me. Cats want the cheese, it. Here, what a cheese, it. Here, get a cheese, it. Yeah, you get one as well. They're a bit of all right, them. They're a bit of all right, them. They're mine, them. That I mean, um. What's this? Rum and butter kisses. Hey, look, he knows me, don't he? Word rum in it. Hey, hey. <laughs> Candied bonbons. Rum and butter kisses, guys. And Josh is going with. The hot and spicy Pringles. Hot and spicy Pringles. I only tried these myself about a month ago. The, they do all right. Is it the um, Zinger ones? Has it got the, the chilies on the side? Yeah, it's got the chilies. Yeah, yeah. They're not bad, them. They're not bad at all. I've never even seen these. Ah, so even though so I did get him something new, I did get him something new that he hadn't seen. Oh, because it's recently come out in the UK, mind. Right. I find that they're really good flavour, and then as you like swallow, you get a little bit of like a heat back in your throat. Obviously, they're not they're not strong and spicy, but I like them. Yeah, that's really good flavour. Nice, that though. They're all right. They're doing, um, uh, they do a spicier version. Um, they just a little bit more heat on the tongue, but still quite nice. Right, guys, look. So we've got um, boom, rum and butter kisses. Let's go. Oh, it's like really soft, like toffee. When it said bonbons at the bottom, I was thinking bonbons, obviously. Yeah. You know what? They, they, they taste like general toffees. 
I got the room flavor coming through though. Wow. Can't try to taste the alcohol flavor. Is there actual alcohol in these or what? I think it's just the flavor. They're alright then though. They're alright. That's probably something that I'll actually enjoy that. I'm going to save for 5 minutes and I'll pull it out of my teeth guys. What else have we got here? Um, um, jam Jams. Jam Jams. Moist jam filled cookies. Cholesterol free. <laughs> Cholesterol free jam filled cookies. Now that's some advertising, isn't it? Let's have a look. They look they're like a it's like a cake version of an Oreo guys. Look, check it out. Oh it smells like um it smells like toffee. Yeah? Can nibble on them. Oh. And what are you going for there? Uh, the cream egg. The cream egg. <laughs> Cadbury's cream egg. I'm not a fan of the cream eggs, mate. Oh, the cream Oh, yeah. Okay, um, um, airheads. I, I, I looked at it and I, oh, I instantly thought of warheads, but airheads. Cherry. So, again, candy bonbons. So, is bonbons a commonly used word for candy in Canada? No? This is the second thing I've seen with bonbons and it doesn't resemble a bonbon at all. <laughs> I bet this, this is going to be nice though, I like these fruit chew bars. Oh, it's, oh, it smells like cherry bakewell. Oh, favourite thing so far. That is, that is scrumptious. Smell that, my mum will smell that, smell that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's the icing, that thing, it's done. Mm. Bakewell, yeah, yeah, yeah. That, guys. That is, that is gorgeous, that. One thing I can say about it is like it's not as chewy as like our ah, fruit chew bars and you can almost feel the grains of sugar in it while you're eating it like grinding on your teeth the texture's a bit weird but the flavour is something else that's going back in my pile as well that's mine for later <laughs> kids aren't having any of that one right um uh, let's try one of these bars, shall we? Got loads of different types of bars here. Mr. Big. That is a big bar as well, guys. I mean, we don't even get... Our, our general chocolate bars are probably about three quarters of that over here. Oh, look, we see what Josh has got in his hand there. He's got the one and only... The Jaffa Cakes. The Jaffa Cakes. <laughs> so, Mr. Big is a, well, it's an original Mr. Big... Um, if you see this picture here, it looks like it's got like wafer, maybe marshmallow and nuts around the outside. Oh, it's made by Cadbury as well. It's a Cadbury's bar. I already know that I'm going to like this. I already know. Yep. We've got something similar, but I can't think what it is. It's like a lion bar. Yeah, it is quite similar to a lion bar actually. Yeah. I think a lion bar is a bit thicker and more dense. But yeah, very similar. My little boy, my two year old boy, absolutely loves Jaffa Cakes. Love it. He'll eat a full packet, I'm telling you now. Eat a box? A box, exactly. <laughs> that is nice, I really like that. I think that one's going to be mine as well. I don't mind sharing, but if it's special, that does. Um, 
A big Turk. If this is Turkish delight, yeah, it is. I'm not even. I can't even go there, guys. I cannot eat Turkish delight. There's no way. It feels really hard, though. Oh, fuck it. For, for, I'll do it for you guys, yeah, but I'm not happy about it. I'm not happy about it. I said I'll try everything and I will do. Oh, it stinks nasty. Oh, look, it's, it's like it's got different pieces that you can break off, look. Oh, my gosh, mate. No. 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 No, that is vile. What sort of weirdo made them? Not for me that one. Not for me that one. That is absolutely disgusting. I need a drink. Very horrible. And they named it Turkish Delight. Delight. There's nothing delightful about it. <laughs> and Josh is going for. I'm going for a crunchy now. The crunchy. The classic crunchy. Can't go wrong with a good crunchy. Oh, I can still taste it in my mouth. No, I used to do a crunches, right? I'd eat the sides, eat the top, and then just eat the crunchy bit on its own. <laughs> so I used to eat them. Right, so Butterfinger. I've heard of these. Might have been on a TV or movies or something. But Butterfinger. I've definitely heard of these. What is it? Crispy crunchy, peanut buttery. Oh, I've definitely heard of this name. Yo, it's like a crunchy sort of thing. No, it's the same thing. It's like, it's like, it's, it's not as nowhere near as dense as the crunchy. But it's got that honeycomb crunch. Very, very strong of peanut butter. Who? That's a bit of something, is that? My teeth's all stuck in my teeth. Oh yeah, I got you. Um, I got the other flavour as well, didn't I? Yeah. 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 Got got yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So, so pickled <laughs> onion, not really my thing, but I, I don't, a bit of the barbecue is quite nice. Nice. Yeah, absolutely. Um, now this bag's resealable and they are called... Oh, new found snacks. So these are actually coming from where Josh is staying. The maid there, I'm guessing, isn't it? You're staying in the place called Newfoundland. And these are new found snacks, spearmint leaves. So I'm guessing these are going to taste like cherry. It's the same as the jam jams too. Yeah. Sweet. Right, check these out, guys. Just a leaf. Obviously, it smells very minty. That straight toothpaste, that man. <laughs> that is toothpaste in a snack. Wow, it's strong. Wow. Wow. Make my eyes go funny. You no, know, your eyes are like, whoa. Oof. Wow. Kids can enjoy them. Not fun. Ooh. Ah. Moams. Uh, oh. The Hubba Bubbas. Oh, it's Hubba Bubbas! Ha <laughs> ha, fight with the Moams! Hubba Bubbas, man, they used to be like the chewing gum when you were a kid. The massive, like, one of them is like having five, six regular chewing gums, isn't it? The massive. They are massive. And I've got something called Twizzler Nibs. Cherry flavoured Twizzler Nibs. I, I, I've got, I'm, I'm under the impression I'm going to like these as well. I, I generally like most um, cherry flavoured sweets. 
Oh, again, it smells like that bar, mate. Oh, yes. Pipe down. Oh, yes. Very, very like rubbery and chewy, but the flavour like makes you forget about the texture. Wow, it's strong. Wow, they pack a punch, them guys. My mouth is still like got the mint going. Oh, that is a oof. What's up next, Josh? Uh, Jammy Dodgers. Jammy Dodgers. I seen them and I thought, bam, that's got to be like a British staple, that surely. It definitely is. Absolutely. I like them the better like when they're really cold, aren't they? They're not warm, if you know what I mean. No, so it's got some pull on it. When they're like warm and it's a bit, not soggy, but it, the jelly breaks apart really easy. Oh, I don't know, what do you call it over there? Is it jelly? Is it jam? Is it jello? Call it jelly, yeah. Jam. jam, jelly. I thought they called it jello. Yeah, jam, jelly. 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 Right. Yep. So these, I instantly assume that they, these are the can Canada's version of Malams, Josh. Yeah. Yeah, I can tell straight away. These are like the Malams that we have over here, the little squares. Yeah, there's actually multiple packets of them. We've got. Strawberry, we've got sh strawberry, orange, and raspberry. I'm gonna go for the orange, try the orange ones. The packets are bigger than ours, I'll give them that. We only get like five of them in, um, are there still 10p the pack of five of them there, aren't there? Yeah. Pack of my arms, the small little squares. Oh, they're actually a lot the bigger as well, there's more and the bigger. Let's give this a go, this, I know, I like these. That's pretty far, I think we're getting there. Yep. That's perfect, I'm gonna take some tablets after this. I know that toothache's gonna come kicking in me in about half an hour. Wow, that was chewy. That was chewy, chewy, chewy. Right, um, I've still got some more crisps, but let's give... I've been eyeing these up for a while, so... These are called Hickory Sticks Original... Ju Julian's Al Hickory. Made by Hostess. So I don't like they're gonna be really little, skinny. So I'm gonna assume we call these... Are we calling these chips? Yeah, the chips. These are chips, guys. Remember, chips. Oh, wow. Check these out, guys. Look at that. They're all little, they're literally as. Slivers, aren't they? You have to get a mouthful of these work to taste them. <laughs> God. They remind me of Walker's Smoky Bacon. They are nice. They are also mine and not the kids. <laughs> Cat, go away. Knock the camera over. Fucking cat out of your crisps. <laughs> hey guys, sorry about that. My camera decided to attack the crisps. Oh, I need to set this back up. What's the cat doing? There we go, guys. I do apologise about that. Stupid cat. Don't worry, I'll kick off camera. It's a joke, it's a joke. Calm down everyone, bloody hell. <laughs> what are you going for, Josh? I'm going for the Fisherman's Friends. Ooh, like, so, the reason I got the Fisherman Friends is I thought, there's no way, I'm sure there's no way that his lass has got, had the Fisherman Friends. I thought, surely, they're like the most powerfulest breath mints in the world. I thought, right, I'll give him some of them. So I know that he's had them, but I thought, she, there's no way that she'll have them. I've had them. Here's a chance, she has been over to the UK a few times, so hey, you never know, I might have been completely wrong, but uh, you know, educated guess. <laughs> oh, 
Well, I can't stop eating these. These are proper nice, mate. They're strong, aren't they? They do the black ones, though. The black ones are stronger than the white ones. There's a black packet and there's a white packet, isn't there? The black one's going to be stronger, isn't it? Yeah, I would assume so. Look at his face, guys. <laughs> they are strong fishermen friends. Wow. Tell you what, they'll play your throat and your nose. These are so nice. Yeah, I'm going to be eating them. I'm off to the pub after I've done this video, so I'll come back and I'll probably pig out on all this munch. <laughs> And then eat too much and throw it up. Yeah, that's what I'm doing. <laughs> you enjoying that? <laughs> <laughs> um, we've got four more items to go, guys. Um, well, well, we'll finish off the questions we were there. So we've got some Liz. Dill pickle. Dill pickle, right? That's interesting. Because I don't really like pickles, so let's see what happens here. I'm the guy that orders a McDonald's burger and has the pickles taken off. Oh, it smells exactly like pickles as well. <laughs> what I do for a YouTube video. So they're pickly, but it's light. It'd be just, it's just like a McDonald's pickle as well, like seriously. They're, they're all right, they're not nasty, but they're not, they're not directly for me then. I'm sure kids will enjoy them. Right, what's Josh going for? I am going for the wine gums. The old wine gums, another classic. I, I, I go straight for the green ones, me. I like the red ones. Mm -hmm. Red ones are really good. Wine gums. I like just about everything that that um, Bassett's makes, apart from the, um, you know, the licorice all sorts, is it the cold? Yeah, but the horrible. The horrible and licorice all sorts are horrible, they're like. <laughs> But just about every other sweet. No, I, no, I was thinking of round tree then, weren't I? Right, so here we've got, we've got some cookies, guys. Original. Tell. the hell? Tellimint, but it's got like five L's. Tellimint. Got five L's in the middle. And they're called Chips Ahoy! Chips are high there, guys. Let's get into these. How many do we get? We've got four cookies in a pack. If you don't like a chocolate cookie, then you're a bit of a weirdo, aren't you? I mean, let's be honest. Oh, they're good as well. Very, very, very light, flaky, chocolatey, sexy. I like to dip my chocolate cookies in milk, me. Then I can go cooking. So this item I got because I love it. It's one of my favourite snacks. It's the black pepper army guys. So um do you do spicy food Josh? Not not often. No. Well see, see how you see how we take this. Don't take a big bite. <laughs> it's, it's, it's not it's not it's not serious, it just it hits you fast, but it's not it's not super hot. Oh I've definitely got the spicy smell. <laughs> I'm looking forward to this. Let's see if he handles it. Hits you a bit back up for a little bit like that. Whoa! <laughs> it hits you, doesn't it? Gets you right there, I swear. Yeah. <laughs> oh, right, the tip of the tongue and then going straight to the throat. It's mad, isn't it? But it, 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 that's, that's as bad as it gets. It doesn't it don't build or anything like that. I mean, it, it's safe. No, no, I don't really burn much. No, no. 
I think uh, they're nice. Once you get used to that initial slap of heat, it's actually really nice and enjoyable. Right, so I have got cottage country salt water taffy. So I've heard about salt water taffy a lot from the like the states, Canada, them ways. Um, the the logo cottage country it reminds me of the cottage cheese logo. Right, salt water taffy. Let's give this a go. I've heard so much about it. Oh, I've got loads of different colours, so I'm gonna go for blue because blue is my favourite colour. Oh, it smells nice. I hope it's not. It's gonna be really salty. Let's go. Alright, I was like fruit juice. Not salty. It's tough. Oh, it is salty. Well, that's weird. That's very weird, but it's not nasty. That's weird. You know what it tastes like? You know when you get like the um, pick and mix boxes and them sweets that are always left at the end, it's like a little tube of them little white circle things, or multicolored circle things. Then, I've had to spit that out. I've had to spit that out, that one a bit salty. No thanks. No thanks. Got some chewing new bit. So I used to love this as a kid. But I swear, when when I remember these as a kid, they were they were massive like when you hold it in your hand it was like a brick. Yeah, yeah, I remember them being so big and all. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, the the nuggets. Oh new yeah. guy. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, the big lumps of sugar. I like them. You, you get the um, random little nuts in them, don't you? I think. Yeah. yeah I like. I did like them. I feel like I'm on a bit of a sugar rush or something. Trying all this. Right. So this is my last item, guys, in my box, and it is called a. Oh, Henry. Literally, it's called an. Oh, Henry. Oh, Jesus. You're a big boy, Henry. <laughs> Let's check it out, guys. Crunchy, ah, oh, dropped a piece. Crunchy peanut buttery. Yo, that's Canadian Snickers, bro. <laughs> See Snickers? Tastes exactly like a Snickers. What company is it made by? If it's necessary, I'm going to piss myself. No. Oh, it's made by Hershey's. Hershey's Canada Inc. Ontario. They stole that recipe from Snickers. <laughs> That's made it look different. The strawberry roll up. Strawberry roll up. If you don't get one of them, you need to pull your head out of the sand. So, while Josh is going through the rest, I'm off back to these hickory sticks because these are absolutely on fire. Tell you, kids are gonna have a field day when they come back with all these. Say that again. It's a little sour. I think it's very sour if you ask me. Wagon wheel I thought would also another choice that I think 
must be sort of British that. There's a few different kinds of wagon wheel, isn't there? I think the one with jam and the other one with is it chocolate inside or is it just plain marshmallow? There's one with chocolate inside too. Yeah, yeah. I think these isn't I'm sure of it. Like a chocolate spread, isn't it like Nutella? Yeah. I'm gonna. Yeah. Are you me some food bags, man? I've got enough left. I just want to wrap these up so they don't go stale. Oh, they were really nice as well. I'll go back to these cheeses. Ooh. Skittles tropical. I thought normal Skittles, eh, tropical ones. Why not? Bags, bags. It's because it's a normal carrier bag. I'll put them in there. Ah, oh, them cheeses, something. Bart noodle! Yeah! <laughs> Get kettle boiled, Josh! <laughs> yummy, yummy, yummy. So, yeah, guys, I mean, that was awesome, that. So, I've got plenty of snacks. I, I, I won't trust some of them, but I will give most of them to the kids. To be fair, there was um, a lot of the items were similar to an item that we've already got. The saltwater taffy, that's very weird, very strange. <laughs> if you get the opportunity to try it, give it a whirl. I thought, when I first started eating, I thought, yeah, fruit chew, then the salt comes through, and you're like, what? The? what? Weird. Turkish delight, disgusting. Probably not even Turkish. No, it is weird, I'm joking. Um, but them, them hickory crisps are probably the most favourite thing I'd, uh, like eat, I'd eat a bag of them like that, you know, the big massive bags, yeah! I'm gonna let this sit for a while. Yeah. Don't want it, you don't want it crispy? No, oh, no it was. Yorkie. Yorkie? It's for boys, not girls? No. Bloody, I can't remember what they were saying, yeah, one. Yeah, it, it, not, not for girls, or not, not for, yeah. Oh, I mean, it's for men? Yorkies were for men? I can't yeah, remember. Yeah, it, it was definitely not for girls somewhere in it, though. But they, they had to change all that marketing, didn't they, because of, you know, all bloody PC and that. Not dickheads, man, no. No, PC political correctness, you know. Not for girls, yeah, not for girls. Not for girls, I'm sure, yeah, not for girls. Yeah, I'm sure it said not for girls. Literally had a picture on the packet, and the O was like, the, you know, the no smoking sign, but it said no smoking with no girls. I'm sure, yeah, yeah, it, yeah, it will be. I, I just, I used to say it on the advert as well, though. Not for girls. So, guys, that was UK versus Canada, snack wars, MB style. Um, really cool, really interesting. Um, if you want to try any of the snacks that you've seen, you can probably find them on Amazon, no doubt. Um, Amazon do most of like the American, Canadian. Um, sort of sweets and snacks, so probably will be better fine. Probably be a bit more expensive, obviously, because you know import taxes, etc. But you better check them out on there. Um, so yeah, very different style of a video on the channel, guys. But I hope you enjoy it. And until the next one, oh, first of all, see you later, Josh. See ya. See ya. See you later, mate. So guys, as you know, as always, until the next one, stay safe, peace, and respect.